So friends, this time we will talk about creating reports in SCADA. We want to print or export the immediate data expressions or the alarms that we control via our panel or SCADA. So we can also create reports in order to save some of the data or all of the data in some cases. Now, how do we want to do this reporting? So let me try to explain that to you. Now this reporting operation is done in a similar manner in the operator panel and in the SCADA. Now some of the steps that I will convey in a minute are done in the same way in both of the operator panel and the SCADA. So now look, first of all I created an empty page named report and I placed the report button into the main screen. Now after adding that um, for the operations regarding reporting we can add a new report via the menu on the left. Friends, uh, when we click that add new report, look, a window will open in a minute. Friends, this window that popped up comes in the same way, both in the SCADA and in the panel. Normally, in our panel menu, we can only see the watermark detail page, expression enabled. Yet, in the menu in the SCADA, we have the header, footer, and the detail page menus as well. This is the only difference regarding the screen that opened. So, in other words, when you want to open the same menu in the panel, you won't be able to see the footer, header, and the detail page options. Now, we have the header tab here. It is the header of the pages of the report. You can add this header to the top of the report and you will see it in every page that belong to the report. You can enter the date, hour, or a simple title as the header. There is also the detail page option in here. Friends, the content of our report and the main things it should have are written here. In other words, the content of the report can be written in the detail page section. Besides, there is this footer tab which allows us to add a footer in every page. So we can also use this in order to add a footer. Well, there is also this watermark detail section. Uh, via this section, you can add covers, uh, content or watermarks for your back page. Uh, we can tell this regarding that. And you can add a little bit more different details as well. Friends, apart from that, let me tell you another thing. So, let's go to our report screen. So when we go to our report screen, we will right click on the header and after right clicking on it, let's go to the, uh, we will go to the properties section. So uh, when we are in it, let's go to the general settings section. Friends, you are able to add new pages such as back page or title page for your report via this method. So, what we call title page is actually the cover. If you want to add a cover page for your report, you can add it from here. The back page is the back cover of the report, so you can add front or back covers from here. Friends, other than that, you may want to remove some of the features regarding the report. Look, if you want to remove the headers and footers, you can do that by deactivating them from here. Look, you can remove or add them by marking these boxes or leaving them blank. Look, when you deactivate them, you can see an X in front of the names of the function in the above panel. So that is as you see. And again, uh, in here you can see that for the headers and the footers, it gave us a 1.5 centimeters of space. Like I said, these are present in the panel in the SCADA. So look, uh, you are able to widen these, widen these headers and so after that let's do something to the footer. So you can set them from here however you want. Well, but actually we can also revert this change to 1.5 cm again. In this way you can perform such operations via the pages.
So other than that, let's right click and before going out into the report properties section, I have got another thing to say. So when you click on expand all pages, all of the pages of the report appear like this. So we have also the headers here as you see. So the footer field is here and the space in between is where we will write our report. So when we click on hide all pages, it hides all of these pages. Well, other than that, we can right click it and um, from there uh, go to its report properties section. So uh, you can make the layout regarding the report from here. So by going to this uh, report properties section, you can make the adjustments regarding the report. You see, these are about the text. Look, these are about the sizes. And for example, this one sets the report's format, which is A4. So you can change many things, such as the page size. And other than that, this is all I can say about this for the moment being. But we will investigate them further. So right now, that is all I can say about the features that are same in the SCADA and the WinCC Flexible. But as we continue, we will see different things regarding these two. For example, uh, let's show you something like that. Uh, let's do something like this. For example, when you right click that, in other words, when I move over to the detail page and right click, a different screen appears. Look, the difference between the menus that pop up when you right click on the other tabs and the one when you right click on the detail page is this pages tab. Friends, the pages tab is where we will write our report. In the others, you have the footer and the headers. But in here, you can add new pages or delete some. Friends, in this pages tab, you can do something like this. You can use the insert after pages or insert before pages settings. Or from here, you can say page down. For example, uh, this one will allow us to go to the upper page if we go to the pages below. So friends, if you want, you can delete the pages you added. Now let's right click it and delete it. As you see, what happened? My pages are deleted. So let's add them again. Look, I clicked on insert before page. I have two pages now. And let's right click that and select delete detail page. As you see, the pages are now deleted. So you can make the settings regarding the report in this way, but like I've said, you can also add a watermark page. This is how one looks like.